With so many of us holding tension in our shoulders, it's really important that we pause, take a breath, and give some love to this part of our body. Today, we'll be doing a short self-massage paired with some really juicy Pilates stretches to help your shoulders feel relaxed, revitalized, and a lot less tense. I'm Hannah Ray. Let's get on the mat. We'll start today off by going right into our self-massage so you can find a comfortable seat, take the hand to your opposite shoulder, and just start to use your fingers to make some gentle circles on the shoulder. I really like to move my head a little to the side when I do this to help me feel a bit deeper into my muscles, but you can really put the head and neck wherever they feel good for you. And you're welcome to rub here all the way down, maybe even reaching towards your shoulder blade, or just stay kind of up on the shoulder and maybe going even a little bit onto your neck if that feels good. And once you've found kind of a juicy spot, hold a little pressure there with your fingers and just slowly roll your shoulder. We'll make three circles one way, three circles the other. And this can feel quite intense. So know that you only need to put as much pressure as feels good for you. Less is more here. Now you can just grab that shoulder and give some big squeezes. We're gonna go all the way even onto the arm with this. And it's really just this motion of kind of grabbing a large chunk of flesh and then pulling it up and off the body. So again, some people like a lot of pressure here. Some people like to keep it pretty light. Do whatever feels good for you. And you can keep it kind of up on the bicep, tricep, or you can go all the way down to your fingertips if you're really enjoying that full arm version of the massage. This will be your last one, whichever you prefer. And then just sit quietly for a moment. Turn your head to the right. Circle the nose down around, little half moon up to the left. Look back to center. And then you're gonna reverse that, just removing any tension. Whew, really nice. Take a moment, close your eyes here. Just notice if your shoulders feel different side to side. And then you can open your eyes and join me. We'll do the other side. Starting with our small circles. Neck can be wherever you want to be. Just take nice deep breaths and enjoy. find your fingers settling onto a juicy spot and hold let's make some circles with the shoulders three times each direction keep breathing <laughs> relax as best you can nice and we'll go for those squeezes all the way through the shoulder and then down the arm as far as you'd like We'll do this three times. Feel free to go your own pace and keep taking nice deep breaths. In your own time, come just to a quiet seat. And again, turn the head and make one half moon in each direction. Go slow here so you don't even need to keep up with me. And when you've finished, we'll all meet lying down on the mat. Knees will be bent, feet planted flat on the floor, lift the arms up overhead. And if you have it with you, a towel or blanket or strap might feel really nice on your shoulders here. So pause the video and grab that if you'd like. And then we'll all meet on the mat, lift your strap if you have it over your head. And if you don't have a strap, that's okay. You'll just use your two hands. And then we're gonna bring the arms slowly back down. Your arms will touch your thighs. Beautiful, so we're gonna move through this really slowly, just giving a deep massage to the shoulders. And I'll encourage you to be active with the arms here. If you have that strap, it might mean actively pulling the strap apart. And that will actually deepen your sensation of massage. 
after your hands have come down to the thighs on this next one, you're going to roll to your side and take a peek at me. You're just going to, if you have your blanket, roll it up. And if you don't have a blanket or strap, no worries. We're just going to put that little prop behind your back. So you'll just return to lying flat on your back if you don't have a prop. But if you do, you'll get this little back bend. We're going to repeat what we did before. Arms are going to go up and overhead and then back down by your side. And if you happen to have a strap still available to you, you can have this little booster behind your back and the strap. That might feel really nice. Just a couple more times like this, feeling into the massage. And if you find that you don't like that extra pressure behind your upper back, of course you can always just return to the version we were doing before and lie flat on the back with nothing behind you. You're gonna take the hands into a big beach ball shape now and then cross right arm over left. Inhale, lift the elbows, and then exhale, elbows press down onto your ribs. It should feel really nice in the upper back and shoulders. Open back to that beach ball, and then cross the other arm over the top. Inhale, elbows lift. Exhale, they press the ribs down. And I'll let you do that twice more on your own. We'll all meet with the arms facing the ceiling now. So reach the fingertips up to the sky and make small circles here with the arms. So you can always peek at the screen if you want to see me. Just making these circles and start it quite small. And then maybe if it would feel good, you can expand and make bigger and bigger circles. But I often find I actually get a better massage with a smaller circle here. So really tune in with your body. Don't assume that a bigger circle will give you more sensation. Taking it the other direction now, starting small and then expanding if you'd like. Nice deep breaths. Enjoy the moving massage. All right, let that go. And to get out of this, if you have the blanket, just roll over onto your side. Take a moment here, take a little breath, let your body rest and kind of re-neutralize after that back bend. And then we'll all come up, <laughs> give the shoulders a little roll, and then you can sit up tall now. We'll bring the blanket or strap back the long way. And you'll sit with your legs in front of you, arms overhead. So again, no strap, no worries. You'll just lift the arms up overhead, plain and lower them back down. So we're just moving through the same motion we did on our backs. And then we'll all meet at the top and hold. You can always bend your knees here if that helps you sit up taller. It's really all about the upper back and shoulders today. And we're just reaching, reaching, reaching with the arms. Nice job, fold forward. And then let's lift back up and sit tall again. We're gonna do this a few times, really smooth and flowing. Forward and then up. Nice job, last time. Excellent, we'll all meet at the top and hold a little longer, really stretch the arms. Lovely, come on down. We can go ahead now and set that blanket or strap aside. Just come to lying on your belly. And take a moment, hands behind the back here, and your head will be over to the right. Now, if your shoulders are really tight, you may wanna grab that strap and hold the strap behind you. But if you can, hands will just be here. Trying to get the hands as high up by your shoulder blades as possible. We'll bend the knees, kick one, two, three. And then if you can, hook the thumbs and just reach behind you. So we're in a little back bend here. And then head goes to the other side, hands return high. Three more little kicks and stretch up. And this exercise sometimes takes a little getting used to. It's a lot of things kind of moving at once. So always feel free to come back to this video. It will get easier as you practice, I promise. We're gonna do it one more time, triple kick. Try to hook the thumbs, reach behind you. Gorgeous, sit back on your heels and we'll enjoy a nice stretch. So you have several options here. One is just to stay here resting. But if you know you're flexible in your shoulders and you want a deeper stretch, start to walk forward. Booty will leave the heels you might get a deeper shoulder stretch here. So you can be wherever you wanna be, wherever it feels best for your whole body. 
keep taking nice deep breaths. Come on up. We'll all meet kneeling arms outstretched. You're going to make sure your abs are hugging in. So tailbone is gliding down the back. We don't want to pop the booty out too much. Inhale, pull the arms behind you and just look over the right shoulder, left shoulder, center, and then exhale, arms reach forward. So we inhale back. This time look left, look right, center, and exhale. Just one more each side. Inhale, look and look and center gorgeous exhale last one inhale pull the arms behind you and look look center exhale very nice we'll all come back to a comfortable seat now we're going to repeat the massage we did at the beginning so bring the hand up and start those slow circles and even if you're in a rush don't skip this part it's going to feel so amazingly different after doing all those stretches you really want to take the time you're going to be able to get deeper into your muscles and it's really worth it to take the time to do it the second time around noticing if maybe your body responds to a little bit more pressure or maybe it doesn't need as much pressure to relax everything's kind of a bit more yielding Let's make those shoulder circles now. So find a spot and hold it while you circle the shoulder. We'll go three times each direction. And now those big squeezes. So you're gonna start right at the shoulder, squeeze, grab up, and come all the way down the arm this time. So even if you didn't come all the way down the first time, this time we're all gonna go down to the wrists and even onto the hand and fingertips, which feels so good. Twice more like that on your own. Take a moment, just sit quietly, maybe close the eyes, and notice how the two sides feel. And then you can join me on the other side, small, slow circles. Pick your spot now, find that juicy place with your fingers and roll the shoulder three times each direction. Go ahead and give that big squeeze now, going all the way down the arm to the fingertips three times. to rinse that all out let's just take three nice big arm circles each direction beautiful and that is it for today you are all done i hope your shoulders feel better come back to this class anytime you need a little bit of tlc i would also love to see you in one of my longer mat classes you can find the link for those in the description and of course you can support this channel by liking commenting and subscribing it helps us out so much thank you and i'll see you next time on the mat